from a small hail with that. Old 27 in Harper County on Highway 160, moving east out of Danville. I'm John Wright. During a tornado warning, take cover in a basement or underground shelter. Protect your head and eyes from flying debris. Take a portable radio with you to your shelter. If you have no basement, go to the interior part of the lowest floor, like a bathroom or closet. Stay away from windows. Get under something sturdy like a branch or table. This is Chance Hayes, meteorologist with the National Weather Service in Wichita. Chef God Blake, I hope you were here. Alrighty, folks, 8:25 on May 29th. About 20 minutes ago, had a quarter mile wedge tornado. And right now at this time. A mile wedge tornado went near Ardemore, Ondemore, something like that. I don't know the name of the town. Yeah, you go ahead and drive. All right, we'll, uh, we'll watch these idiots. Let's see how far they get in there. Sorry about the jibbiness of this, guys. Okay, now you, you got smart. You go ahead and get closer there, sweetheart. Dumbasses. See, folks, that's what we talk about. If there is a tornado, it is rain wrapped in that mess. Right there, that is a rain shaft that is definitely not. We've got RFD here starting to kick up pretty intensely. Uh, looking above us right now, uh, I am clear of any immediate danger with the exception of very strong winds which are starting to feed into this thing. I don't know what that is. That, I don't know. that car has disappeared in there. There's some developing right in front of us here. A lot of dust being blown into this thing right now. The inflow is just insane. Sorry I'm shooting through the windshield, you are not going to see me get out of this car with the lighting that's in the area right now. Tremendous, tremendous amount of lightning. That car continues to go up there. Good God, they're stupid. Alright, the, the dust being kicked up on the road right there is no indication that you probably don't want to drive up there. That's why I'm sitting back here. We have a rotating wall cloud. I'm going to have a tornado touchdown right in front of us here. Keeping an eye on it. It's definitely got some inflow. In fact, I'm going to back out of here. Right now, I think. Just in case. further south.
backing south here as this thing looks like it's trying to back build. We got all sorts of stuff going on under this thing right now. I mean, all sorts of stuff. This is just a sick, sick storm. We got a possible funnel cloud trying to work its way down just to our south, I'm sorry, just to our northwest. I have pulled out of that area chasing the fab here at the intersection of the highway. I uh, have gone south to get out of the way of whatever that thing is coming out of the sky. We're gonna join this little fab of people here gathered at the intersection, but we have moved out of the way. Just proceeding to get out of the way of that as it is spinning right over where I was just positioned. I'm doing on the I'm going to get the hell out of there. That's all I can say. We are due east of Argonia on Highway 1. God, this has been a blessing highway, I'll tell you what. We've got just this incredibly rotating wall cloud heading east-northeast. Uh, we're going to end up... God, this, this is just been unbelievable. I don't think I don't I just it, it, it could go I, I still have some light inflow not as not as heavy as it was back over on the other side of that thing so not as much inflow but still spinning like a top Funnel after 
funnel just got it once too. There it goes. Tornado on the ground. Just lifted. We have a nice little peep there. I don't know what that makes it for the day. Five, maybe six. We might be close to double digits by now. Look at the rotation in those clouds. Still debris being kicked up on the ground. I'm zooming out of here so I can map my area a little bit, figure out where I'm going to go. The storm is moving northeast. We've got several northern options. We're not very far from the interstate. There's another one. 